Okay, this is uh, My Digital Vibes, my uh, podcast and blog. And uh, what I want to talk about is, uh, got this little device right here. I don't know how well you can see it. This is the Sansa, uh, SanDisk Sansa Fuse. Uh, got it a couple weeks ago. It's 2 gig, um, relatively cheap. But when I brought it home and uh, tried to hook it up to my Mac and sync it up and, and put podcasts and whatever on there, there was no way to do it. So I, I listened to about 30 podcasts uh, total. And so what I was able to do was I found this really cool program called Sync Tunes. And let me switch to that. Okay, this is the uh, Sync Tunes homepage. It's uh, at nestfield.co.uk slash SyncTunes. And it's a program that will allow you to use a regular MTP device, such as a, a non-iPod device, and uh, sync it up with your iTunes. And this program just basically goes in between the two, uh, allows you to download all of your podcasts or uh, music, whatever uh, you use iTunes for. You download all of your media and you plug this device in and sync it up and it works. Well, the sad news is, is SyncTunes is no longer being produced. Um, there were some issues uh, with it deleting a couple of files uh, on two known cases. Um, but you can use uh, version 2.0.0 release 2. Now, you're not going to find it on the Nestfield site. You're going to have to go to uh, download.com and do a search for it there. Um, there's two other places that you might find it, um, and that would be, uh, let's see, where did it go? Mac Update and uh, one of the other Mac shareware sites. So anyway, you can still find it. You better go grab it quick. Um, like I said, I got it at download.com. So now you got the you got your device. Let me switch back to the other camera here. All right, you got your device. You plug it in. And it plug it into the USB on the iMac, and it shows up as a regular drive. Um, on mine, it shows up as two drives because uh, mine is a uh, two gig device, and I have a two gig uh, micro SD card in it. So it shows up as as two drives. Uh, Sansa Fuse and then Untitled. And so I want to put it on Untitled because I want to keep all of my podcasts on my 2 gig drive. So we'll switch back over here and I'll show you the software. Okay, so this is, I'm sorry, this is so small. I wish I could figure out how to zoom in on it. Anyway, this is the software here. Um, what you do is you create a playlist in iTunes, and you load up the playlist, and you select your volume. And right now, I've got all these different volumes loaded up, and I want the untitled volume. So I take that, and you've got some other selections, um, destination folder, you've got audio or music, transfer files, which are MP3 format. Um, and all you do, now I've got, uh, let's see, probably 15, 15 different uh, things to sync up, uh, just updates to, to the podcast I listen to. And I'm just going to hit the sync button. And hopefully it's looking for about 249 meg that it's going to sync up. 
So that may take a little while there. Anyway, while that's sinking, um, now I can't find the download.com link, but I will find it and I'll put it in a blog post at mydigitalvibes.net. You can see the URL scrolling across your screen. Now I'm doing this uh, video recording with a cool program I found, a freeware application called CamTwist, uh, version 1.7. Uh, for the Mac and uh, I'll put that link in as well it uh, allows me to switch between multiple cameras and uh, I can stream to uh, Ustream or uh, some of the other stick cam and there's several other sites that you can uh, stream live media to and it's really nice because you can you know go with the different channels different cameras you can add effects like I've got the little logo uh, down in the bottom and then I've got the text scroller and there's all sorts of different effects that you can add alright now we're gonna switch back over here okay and it showed that it transferred uh, nine playlist tracks and three podcasts and that didn't really take all that long and now my device has the latest uh, podcast for this week I hope that's informative for you I will put uh, links to download.com where you can actually still download the sync tunes uh, program uh, if you do find it yourself, just remember that it's version 2.0.0 uh, release 2. And that's about all I have for this particular video. And uh, we'll be doing some more very shortly. Thank you. Bye-bye.